All right, welcome back everybody to episode 32 of our Let's Play. So before we begin this week's activities, I think we're going to go exploration instead of doing battles, just because I'm itching to get on with the story here. Um, I, as much as I would love to do the remaining two paralogues, I just, I don't feel like it. So, <laughs> so I also don't want to be too overleveled for the story, which I feel like I'm. my characters are pretty strong. So before we start, let's get some certifications out of the way. I've had a little bit of a thought about this, and Edelgard, the only class she can go into is Fortress Knight, and I actually don't want her to do that. As much as I was considering her being armored, it just kills her speed if she goes into it. Like, here, I'll let you look. Six speed? I really don't want that, and she's already got pretty bad speed, so I'm going to go into Thief for a few levels to try and actually patch that up. Uh, and bring up her sword level in the meantime so that maybe we can go into one of the other sword classes in the advanced. Uh, she's got plenty of defense and resistance, so... We're gonna do that. I know it's probably a waste of growth uh, for the next couple levels, but must be done. Ferdinand is going to actually go into Paladin. Um, that's a no-brainer. So we've got our first advanced class here in Ferdinand. And his lank is doing his lance rank is doing quite well. I'm not sure what I want him to go into in terms of the master classes, so we will have to start focusing on um, what kind of master class we want him to be in terms of weapon usage. So, if we want great knight, we're gonna have to focus on axe and heavy armor instruction as we're going up, which shouldn't be too difficult. The heavy armor A is a massively difficult requirement though, so I don't know about this one. Uh, otherwise, holy knight should be easy enough to do because his lance rank is there, his riding rank will get there, and the faith rank shouldn't be too hard to get. Uh, same if we want dark knight. So any one of these knight classes, well, bow knight may be out of the question, so Dark Knight and Holy Knight, I don't know. I'll have to think about it a little bit and see. Having a Dark Knight would be cool. So maybe we try to gun for that. Might not be a bad idea. Uh, Great Knight, I don't know how feasible getting heavy armor to A is just through instruction. That's kind of steep. Anyways. And then our last one here that's ready is actually Shamir. Uh, now... I also kind of want her to go into something of a, a sword assassin kind of class because like the last class is here for master that she can go into. Master classes are kind of limited. So if she either goes into bow knight, which she's kind of ready for, but would need some riding instruction to go into, which we're kind of working on passively. So that's not too bad. And her lance rank is already there. But I think if she goes into sniper and starts chaining swords... Eh, maybe it would be better to go sniper and just focus horse instead of dispersing all the uh, energy. Maybe we just go bow knight with her. I think trying to turn her into a falcon knight or a moral savant, probably not the best idea. Yeah, I think we just go bow knight with Shamir, so I guess we go... I mean, the idea was to patch up her speed a little bit. She has a 40% speed growth, so if we were able to go, again, Thief and fix her speed, because she's got respectable strength, high dex, but her speed is a bit lagging, so maybe we also side-class her to Thief. She actually doesn't have access to that. We need to train her swords. Okay, she's going to go Sniper. She's going to train swords. Maybe she hops back to Thief. I don't know. We'll see. Let's take her to Sniper, because otherwise we're wasting... Wait, she's already Sniper? Was she always already an advanced class? Huh. Maybe she wasn't, I just didn't notice. Alright, well, I guess we can't change her to anything else, so we sh might as well just focus on swords for the time being. That was the decision made for us. Alright, I guess we don't get to reclass anyone else. Um... Petra mastered her Thief class, so part of me kind of wants to... I forget what she got. She got Steel. Since Edelgard's Thief, we're actually, we can actually change her to Mercenary. That'll boost her Strength Growth a little bit. Which she's also kind of lagging in, so we're going to keep that. 
And I don't know if we want to reclass anyone else. I think everyone else is pretty much okay where they're at. I'm considering changing Bernadetta to a flyer. Yeah, let's do it. I wonder if she can still use bows. She can. Okay, that's good. Because I think Falconite for Bernadetta at the end would be a good idea. And she's kind of already moving towards that with having some flying training, some lance training. She doesn't have the sword, though, so I don't know. We'll see. Maybe we work on swords with her a little bit as we go along. Hubert, unfortunately, I think, is just not going... Well, maybe he can be a Dark Knight. Or we might just make him... Yeah, maybe he can be a Dark Knight. He's got the Lance rank. He's got the reason. He doesn't have the riding, which is going to be a pain to level up. Especially since we've kind of been focusing on flying... Yeah, Hubert might have to go Dark Knight at the end. I know I didn't really focus on, like, min-maxing this ahead of time. Linhart can definitely go Holy Knight. We've been focusing riding hard with Linhart, so if we just focus Lances a little bit with him, the riding might come in due course. But anyways, that's enough talk of that. Uh, let me look at supports real quick. We might have a couple, and then we can do the exploration. I think that'll be, there's there's going to be plenty to look at this episode. Maybe some story stuff before the next episode, so. Shamir, you are training away from the ground of training. Ah, Petra. Well, it looks like it might rain. I have understanding. Rain training can cause unhealthiness. Can I give you a question now? Sure. You come from Dagda, I think. Why are you working at the monastery? You can tell I'm from Dagda? Oh, I suppose Bridget is our... Yep, it is. As for why I work here, that's simple. I work to live. Rhea took me in when I had nowhere else to go. I'm here to repay my debt. I don't plan to return to Dagda anytime soon. But Fodlin is an enemy for you, right? Are you feeling okay about that? The only ones I've fought in person are the Imperial Army. I carry no ill will toward anyone else. I have gratitude for your answering. How about you? Do you hate them? The Empire is your father's... It's interesting to no. see... And it's Dagda's their ideologies... Into the war at all. ...towards the Empire so and the Church you because Dagda? they've been... Or do you see that as none of your concerns? ...enemies in the past time. The fault is not of Dagda. My father made his own choice to be joining the war. I cannot say I have no hatred for the Empire. But I do not have any for Edelgard. When I came here, she was always helping me. Makes sense. You can hate a country without hating its people. You speak with such honesty. That is very, very, very true. Amazing. You can hate a country without hating its people. I agree with that 100%. I just don't let emotion. Without getting into politics, of course. She has a decent support. Caspar and Ash. Hey, Ash, what's with all the noise? Did something happen? I only just heard myself. Looks like a thief got into the pantry and made off with some of our food supply. Stealing from a monastery? What kind of monster would do such a thing? Come on, we gotta get that dirty thief. Definitely. I'm sure we can capture the culprit if we work together. Capture? What are you talking about? Why bother? This is the kind of person who would steal from a monastery. We gotta take this guy out. It's probably Bernadetta in the night raiding the food pantries. How do you expect to get rid of the evil in this world if that's how you're gonna treat it? What? I should be the one asking you that. 
The first thing we need to do once we've caught this person is hear what they have to say. They might have been forced into a life of theft by some awful circumstances. You really don't get it, do you? If you let people get away with stuff like this, it's only going to get worse. If we're going to uphold justice, justice. Then we stop evil. So I'm all for the rule of law. But indiscriminate slaughter isn't going to solve anything. You can't just execute someone on a wild assumption and call it That justice. is true. And you can't just hide behind your fancy words. You have to take They action. sound really similar. It's kind of annoying. You know what? Forget it. There's no point in arguing this with you. We're going to have to fight this one. Ah, uh, yes. Whoever wins gets to make the plan. Got it? Oh, uh, what? How is fighting supposed to decide who's wrong and who's right? We're not barbarians, are we? Just take it easy and we can talk this over. We don't have time to take it easy. The thief is getting away and all you want to do is talk and... Hey, did you hear? Apparently they caught the thief who stole the food. All's well that ends well, right? Oh, come on! You hear that? You just cost me my... There you go. Hey, if they've already been caught, let's just leave it at that. All right, that support's out of the way. I think... Because I also am looking at my own class change, and I kind of wanted to go Swordmaster, but my sword rank is only C+. So I don't know what's going to happen. I think I wasted a lot trying to get lances up and stuff like that, so... I figure maybe we go, we train some swords. We get some unit motivations up for Edelgard. We get motivation up for... Uh, Shamir so that we can make sure that they have their reclass options available for what we want them to do. So yeah, so we're gonna go explore. Make sure everyone's motivated to train. And we'll do that. Well, maybe we can go to a seminar actually. Uh, I don't know. Yeah, we might. I think exploring is the better idea. Oh, wait. No one can be tutored right now. Ah. Uh... Okay, Byleth and Edelgard would attend this seminar with Manuela, which increases swords. Catherine probably does better with swords. Also Edelgard, okay. That would be a good one. Who else do we need to level up swords in? D Shamir kind of wants swords. Yeah, I think we go with Catherine and we just do seminar. Because I don't really see the value in exploration right now, unless we're going to just train Arvis alone. I think a seminar might be valuable. I hope I don't regret this. Yeah, because Edelgard does need to get up her sword rank as soon as possible. Yeah, screw it. Let's just go seminar. It's been a long time since I've done a seminar. I think I still have some time anyways. It's all instinct now. The ball is tomorrow. I have no worthwhile memories of such events, yet I'm still looking forward to this one. As am I, in the sense that I look forward to destroying <laughs> all the unworthy suitors who will inevitably swarm Lady Ada. I will admit, Edelgard is adorable. However, when it comes to elegance on the dance floor, I am... All so right, Ferdinand. You're not a bad dancer, Ferdy. But you do have some moves that are hard to watch. You honor me with your kind words. 
I understand that I am sometimes too dazzling to behold directly. I'm envious of your positive attitude. I also know how to dance, in theory. Maybe I should participate as well. Not me! You wouldn't catch me dancing at a ball any sooner than you'd catch a fish swimming through the sky! <laughs> well, you do tend to flop around like a fish on the land, after all. Well, why would you say that? Now I feel like a fish on a skillet. On a skillet? <laughs> <clears throat> Never mind. Speaking of the ball, do we get to pick who we dance with? I wonder who I should ask. A bold subject change. Should Lady Edelgard wish it, I would be Oh, honored. don't get shot down. I will fight. With all fight? That I it's have dancing. What are you fighting? Fighting? No, that's not really the point. I will not be as a fish upon the flame. <sighs> Good work, Burn. I have a proposition. Let's all agree to meet back at the monastery exactly five years ago. Wait, today. wait, 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 wait. Is the time skip literally happening right now? Like a class reunion? It's a great idea. Five years from today will be the Millennium Festival for Garrig Mock Monastery. I've heard the magnitude of the festivities will exceed all prior years. Wait, I, they, it can't, they, they can't be throwing the time skip on us right No, 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 there's no way. We have to have a few more months. how much growing I have done. They haven't graduated yet. Maybe it's just they're talking about this date. Who knows where each of us will be in five years' time, or who we will become. Still, I have faith that all of us will gather and celebrate our reunion. That's assuming the professor is still here in five years, and not enjoying a cozy early retirement. <laughs> Even if that's the case, you will come, won't you? Whether or not you're still- I'll think about it. Don't forget, my teacher. Even if the Millennium Festival should be cancelled, I promise to return here. Okay. Oh, we got a cutscene. We saw a little bit of this in the E3 trailer, I think, but let's watch and see what's going on. Now she's dancing with some random dude. Where's Hubert? Reach for my hand. Running away. Yes. I understand. You hardly had the time to breathe. Why does he always look so angry? It must be hard to be the favorite teacher at the ball. <laughs> so you do think you're the favorite. <laughs> I might have known. But where is there to run? This place is filled with joyful students looking for a dance. Ah, I see. The Goddess Tower waits for you. The Goddess Tower? Uh, no? Are you saying this is a coincidence? How disappointing to think you didn't come here specifically to see me. Still, if we're meeting by complete chance, that has a certain appeal too. It's as if destiny brought us together. Nope. 
<laughs> and tonight is the night of the ball. Lucky me. Oh, that's just when you're looking through me in front of others. When it's just us, I kind of like it. Originally, I wanted to see what you'd do when you read my letter. I just wanted to see if you'd come here like I What asked. letter? I, though, I suppose you didn't even read the letter to begin with. I should just be thankful I wasn't left here waiting. All alone. Forever. Do you know it's been almost nine whole moons since you arrived at Garrick? Yes. You must have found a special someone by now, haven't you, Professor? Uh, oh no. I have. Oh, who could it be? You've made me so curious. Not you. Oh, don't worry. I'm not going to pry if you don't want to share. Your private life is private, after all. Well, I ought to get going. All right. I wouldn't want to be in the way of your special someone. Should Good. I? Either way, I do hope you'll share a dance with me later. <laughs> It seems that everyone is having a delightful time. Well, I wonder what that was about. Maybe that like jogs them to S support if you answer correctly. I'd rather not, to be honest. How dull of you. Had I a body of my own? Oh, I would see. Oh, you're not the only one who feels that way. Look over there. Hmm. I'm bored beyond compare. Will you not? So go? this I'm not your plaything. Oh, come on, hurry up. I know that you are curious to see what she is up to. I hear someone sing. singing from over there. Okay, what next? Oh, I guess we were supposed to click into it. I feel that I have heard it in the past. Actually, it is not that I have heard it. I... Did I once sing that song to someone? No, there's more. I wrote this song. Okay. Oh, but how could that be so? If that were true, then how could she be singing it? Unless... No, no. I am suddenly so exhausted. As are you, no doubt. Quickly then, to bed with All you. All right. Now's the day of the mission? Sure. Uh, let's save. It's been a long time since I've updated file five. Usually I keep a save on a separate file just in case. Uh, we don't have any new supports. We don't have any inventory to worry about. We did all the item management earlier, so I guess we just hop into the mission and see what's going on. Salvation at the chapel. All right, hopping into chapter nine, finally. It's, it seems like a long time between eight and nine because I did a bunch of... Captain? Captain, where are you? Hey, Professor, have you seen your old man? 
Too bad. I guess it will have to be you then. I'm back. Sorry for the delay. The last mission took longer than expected. All right. Captain, thank goodness you're here. There are reports of demonic beasts. Near demonic the beasts. Nonsense. I haven't heard anything about the monastery's walls being breached. That's why I'm heading there now to see what's really going on. You'll join as well, won't you? Of course. We're both sworn to protect this place. It's odd. Just before they appeared, someone saw a number of students heading toward the students. Town. They were apparently acting strange, as though they weren't in their right. Oh lives. no! Shortly after, demonic beasts started to appear, one after another. Hmm. The students. There's no the demonic beasts demonic are the students. The They're lagoons. Well, that matters right now. We need to act. Go summon your students. Damn it! I wanted to talk to you about something important, but there's no time. Oh, there's never any damn time. But this is much more urgent, so it can hold for now. I'll meet. All right, later. let's do it. Yeah, we know all this tutorial stuff here on screen. That's fine. Okay, so we haven't fought any of these lizard ones before yet. This is huge. How many of them are there? Okay, so there's a chest here. Make note of that. A normal student here, who I guess we need to protect. Oh, God. I wonder if we're not going to get screwed over and these students just transform into the demonic beasts. That sucks. Alright, so what we're going to do is... Uh, I can't move Edelgard to the front, that sucks. And Byleth can't move to the front either. I mean, Shamir can. I wanted to try knocking this one out, like, or both of them at the same time, but that's not going to happen. Doesn't look like it, at least. Uh, we can focus that middle one. That one should be able to get knocked out, but we're then going to get swarmed by these two at the same time, which we really don't want to happen. And Geralt's here with us as well. Ah, whatever. We might as well just jump into it and see what's going on. Um, hang on. We might need to repair items. Welcome. Let's just check. I know we were running low for some people. Yeah, Iron Sword needs to be fixed. Is that the one? Thanks a bunch. Oh, yikes. That one's expensive to fix. We don't need to fix that just yet. Edelgard's fine. Wait, why do we have Hanuman with us? Hang on. I knew something was wrong. Get out of here. There we go. Now the squad looks right. I was like, why are Hanuman and Mel Manuela with us? That just looks wrong. Okay, Bernadetta's here now. Casper's here. All right, let's figure out how we're going to do this. I guess we're doing this all in one episode. This might be a long one. There really are demonic beasts here. They're emerging from the chapel. I'll head that way. The rest of you, protect the students who weren't able to get away. Help me! These beasts, they're... Uh, somebody, help me! You stupid beasts! Don't you dare come over here! So there's three students we gotta pr protect. I will get the victory. 
Yikes, that's a lot of damage. It was Shamir's bows that I needed to fix, right? Damn it. Why did I stop fixing people's weapons? Yeah, let's go back to the battle screen, just fix our weapons, because we hadn't started yet. We can skip all the story stuff. Yeah, we really need to fix the weapons. That was my bad. I totally forgot. Um, I don't know why I forgot. I was literally doing it. Hopefully there's no reinforcements in this chapter. All right, now let's quiet Anna. Repair. Okay, Shamir. Oh, that's because they weren't with us. Is that the one? Thanks a bunch. Is that the one? Thanks there a we bunch. go. Petra's weapons are okay. Let's repair the silver sword just for Is no. We'll leave that. That's an expensive repair. Ferdinand should be okay. Where's Bernadetta? Her weapons need to be repaired. Is that Thanks a bunch. Uh, the iron bow's fine. Okay, now we're good. Come back. All right, okay. And of course it didn't save the placements that we had. To work. Crit! Come on! Nope, okay. Getting any crits, which is annoying, but understandable, I guess. That's my cue. Yeah, Dorothea doesn't kill. I will prevail. Unless as you wish. I am Ferdinand von Eyre. The rapier does bonus damage to this guy? Huh. Oh, it's because it's a sword. I think we're better off just attacking with the normal rapier. It's got a crit chance, and the monster can't double us either in return, so if he crit... Oh, there we go. That's a crit. It's still going for the student. All right, so we're gonna have to try and split into two teams. I think Hubert goes this way, and Dorothea goes with this squad here. Who's this guy targeting? Caspar for 19 damage, that's totally fine. Stay focused. Oh, they heal. That's not good. Oh, 
Oh, the student dodged that 86% missed. Yeah, that one's gonna be like near impossible to save. I don't know how we're gonna get up there that fast. That beast. There's a stone or something on its forehead. Monica? What? All right, well, we're gonna need to absolutely charge ahead as fast as possible. Uh, we're in a tough, not tough spot here. Because if we want to kill it, we really want to kill it here. Yeah, this one needs to die. Death. I guess it's got a high crit rate, so if it crits, that'll be good. Nice! Clutch! Great level up, too. It's got high defense. But if we break this, then we can probably kill it between... Oh, she got a critical. Okay, everyone's getting critical hits today. Ferdinand should be able to finish it off here. Let's go for a combat art. Yeah, Tempest Lance Crescent should be able to... I wonder, Tempest Lance Iron? Yeah! Only a fool challenges me. It's a student, that's what I thought. Can this be? Thank you, but back to the fray. All right, now let's try and figure this out. So Edelgard can kill here with just a normal Steel Axe swing. Yeah, I guess this kind of combination can also do it. Although I wonder if we walk straight up to it, because that'll do more damage, right? No. Yep, let's just hit it where it hurts. Yep, on the weak spot. You were wide open. Growth is a
Yeah, we gotta lure her in somehow. Or lure it in somehow. Let's heal Caspar. Yeah, I don't know how this one's gonna survive. That's gonna be a tough call. They better have vulneraries or something to heal themselves with while we get up there. Alright, cool, they do. So the game isn't totally unreasonable. Okay, so we have to kill this one this turn. Which we can totally do if we just hit a weak spot. Oh, Smash should break it open. Yeah, let's crack it open. The dodge would have been very nice, but it's fine if he doesn't want to. We've got Physic for that reason exactly. And now I think Edelgard should be able to just ravage him. Oh, so close. Okay. Can Shamir kill? No. Burden ends one space too far as well. If Linhart can heal Caspar, how much does this guy do to Caspar? Nineteen. Okay, Linhart. Linhart doesn't really need to heal. Oh, he kills him. Just kills him. Uh, yeah, we do need to heal Caspar. Thanks for helping. We also need to send a thief to pick up the chest. Do we have any chest keys? We do! Alright, let's figure out how we're gonna solve this. Twenty damage. Okay, so Petra can take a hit from this. Okay, so maybe it is possible to kill this thing right now. Monster Breaker with the Steel Axe Plus. Let's do it. Maybe she'll crit. Yeah, never mind. Just a normal silver sword slice. Nothing. Oh, okay. Are we 
done. You're making me look bad. It went for Edelgard? All right. Sure. That student better better heal themselves. Oh, Geralt coming in hot with the Silver Lance. I mean, that helps. Okay, good. They're healing themselves. Because we definitely need... You know what, we're gonna send Bernadetta to go grab the chest because she can get there in maybe two more turns. We're definitely gonna need more than two more turns to take this guy down. Let's focus right now on taking this one down. Yeah, let's use the rapier, why not? Oh, that's the Iron Lance, but he's gonna kill it, so that's good. Thirty-six damage with the Leaven Sword. All right. Nice. Got being swords now. Should learn axe breaker. All right, we saved all the students except the last one up there. Linhart, where are you, bro? We need you to physic on Petra so that she can lure that last beast in. Yep, should be able to get that chest next turn. Uh, should we just step out of range of this thing? And heal Geralt? Let's do that. Just to make sure we can get the treasure. And then, yeah, next turn we should be able to finish it off, no problem.
Just going hard with his silver lance over there, poking away at it. All right. Now we should be able to easily take it down. Just grab this chest here. Does she not have the chest key? Oh my god. I thought I traded for it. All right, well, I guess we gotta wait another turn now. Just let him attack Petra. Oh, Gerald got a kill. He got a kill and he pieced it fast. All right, let's open the chest. Healing staff, well, we didn't really need that. How much does Dorothea do with her 11 sword again? 27, okay, so we need to do a 27 damage at least. There you go, perfect. Winning's always it is, isn't it? Sorry. That was a close It was, one. wasn't it? You saved me. Thank you. That was seven turns with us wasting turns. And she was the MVP, which is good. <sighs> there isn't a trace of evidence to be found in the chapel. This must have something to do with Remire. Perhaps... Wait! Huh? Another student? Run along now. Thanks for all your help, sir. <laughs> <laughs> oh, what? You're just a pathetic old man. How dare you get in the way of my brilliant plan, dog. Wow. Monica, what are you doing? Run along now. Thanks for all your help. Oh, that's sir. the future vision. <laughs> oh, what the hell? Now someone else pops in to change the vision? Jeez. Huh? What are you it's doing this here? guy. You must survive. Merely because there is still a role that I require you to fulfill. <laughs> What the, I, I don't, I don't get what's going on. So he can also Sorry. read the future that we can, oh. It looks like I'm going to have to leave you now. <laughs> to think that the first time I saw you cry. Your tears would be for me. So why of all people did they... It's sad. <sighs> I'm happy for it. Thank you, kid. Monica, what are you doing?
Wow. I can't end the episode like that. We gotta keep we gotta keep watching to see what's going on. So this is where your father lived. Hmm? Are you still crying? If turning back the hands of time was not enough to save his life, you must accept what came to pass was fate. Oh yeah, we're gonna make the enemies pay, all right. Agreed. We cannot let the wicked ones run. The through. Slytherins in the dark. Oh, your father said to look for something here. He must have been referring to whatever is behind that bookcase there. Yep, that was what he said. Your father's diary. Huh. His handwriting is prettier than his face would suggest. Well, well. These entries here are from before your birth. He seems to have been writing this for quite some time. Hmm? Oh. Read that part there. Horsebow Moon. Year 1159. Day 20 of the Horsebow Moon. All is cloudy. I can't believe she's dead. Lady Rhea said she died during childbirth. But is that the truth? And still, day 20. Oh, we missed that. Hang on. Moon. It's still rainy. the child. Sh the baby doesn't laugh or cry. Not ever. Still, the child she traded her life for doesn't make a sound, didn't even cry at birth. Raining, baby doesn't laugh or cry ever. That's five days later. Lady Rhea says not to worry about a baby that doesn't cry. It isn't natural. We had a doctor examine the child in secret. He said the pulse is normal, but there's no heartbeat. No, no heartbeat. heartbeat? What? Day two of the Wyvern Moon. Sunny, I feel I must take the child and leave. But the church is always watching us. I don't know what Lady Rhea has planned. I used to think the world of Lady Rhea. Now I'm terrified of her. Day eight of the Wyvern Moon. More rain. I used the fire that broke out last night to fake the child's death. Lady Rhea is in a state over the news, but I can't change what I've done. I've got to take the child and leave. Well now, that baby must be you. That means... Hmm? Someone is approaching us. I'm sorry if I'm not reacting during this. I'm like shocked and I'm trying to listen to the story and see what's going on. Ah, here you are. To think that Captain... that Gerald would meet his end like that. I hope you know that you were the most important thing in the world to him. He wasn't the most emotional guy. I'm sure expressing his affection wouldn't have come naturally to him. After what's happened, it's up to me now. I, Alois, swear to protect you in the captain's stead. <sighs> Sorry. This isn't the time for my blathering. Lady Rhea is looking for you. Man, what does she want? Come on. I'll this book is filled with secrets yet unknown. We must return another time to read the rest. Oh, but I have at least figured one thing out. I know now why our fates are intertwined. Professor, I have been waiting for you. I am filled with grief at the loss of our most celebrated knight. Gerald was an ally of many years, and also a dear friend. Yeah, except he was scared of you, so I don't know what's going on here, but there's some shady stuff going on with you. It was a long while back. At the time, Gerald was a soldier of the kingdom. He was injured in battle. And I saved him just as he was about to perish. That was our first meeting. After that, he became a knight of Seros. He gave his all in service of the church. 
He fell in love with one of the nuns here at Garagmark. Their love produced a child whom she died giving birth to. It was her decision. She weighed her own life against that of her child's and, in the end, implored me to save the child. Your father never truly accepted that decision. He took the child, took you, and disappeared without warning. Except he faked the child's death, so how do you know that? Your mother, she was... Sister? I'm sorry for the interruption. Oh, come on. Eloise, man, get out of here. We were here in the good part of the story. Come on, man. A report from the knights patrolling the area. Very well. Professor, you are dismissed for the day. Please rest and focus only on mending your heart. Yeah, the one that doesn't Understood. beat, apparently. Oh, it's going to be so sad to hear this in Geralt's Heart voice while he's dead now. White clouds. Guardian moon. Where the goddess dwells. Long ago, the guardian Saros made an appearance during this moon. She had been summoned by the goddess, whose soul was suffering as the flames of war raged across Fordland. Some believe that high in the sky above Saros, the Immaculate Ones, mighty wings are what powered the strong winds carrying the Guardian and her forces into battle. Yeah, I'm shook. I don't know what to say. That was uh That was a little bit of twist. We got a ton of gold. Who wants to come for a support right now? It's like we're crying here. here. Oh, Edelgard, it's just story stuff. Professor, you've been crying. So, even you cry sometimes. Oh, I suppose that was thoughtless of me to say. My teacher, you're so blinded by grief that you can't see what's going on right in front of you. Are you waiting for time to heal your wounds? Or have you curled up in a corner and lost the will to carry on? It does. You've lost yourself. Only you can truly understand your own sadness. Others can sympathize or even empathize, but all anyone else can offer are the tears of an outsider. That is very true. No one can ever understand someone else's complete grief. So I have no intention of crying for you or of standing still with you. All I can do is promise to reach, reach my for hand my hand. Move forward. The mysterious organization that was carrying out experiments in Remyer Village and the chapel. They're up to something near Garrig Mach. The Archbishop has sent the Knights to undertake a large-scale investigation. No information has surfaced yet, but our enemies will soon be discovered. When they are, will you lead us into battle? Or will you just sit here, with no thought for the future that is fast approaching? My teacher, there is a choice to be made. I hope you make it's it Monica's way. fault. My, my. She really is quite arrogant. She spoke her mind without an ounce of reservation. You know, I, I, I don't have bad ideas about Edelgard because of that, because I do this sometimes. It's like tough right. love, you know? The time has come to stand again. You know already what your answer is. Oh, thank you. You saved me. If you were to die, then the mystery of our bodies would be revealed. Preventing that was my only... So she's not working with them? I'm afraid you must remain, Kronya. There is something... I oh, this is Kronya. Oh, of course. I'm always...
always happy to cooperate with Solon. Leave it to me. How annoying. Flame Emperor, is she offending you? Unfortunately, we cannot take our eyes off her, so there is nothing to be I guess, so these guys are all experimenting separately then? You are our greatest creation. We use the defiled beast's blood as the fuel to your flame, that you may burn even the gods. Now is the time to cleanse Fodlin with that power and bring forth our salvation. There will be no salvation for you and your kind. Those responsible for such gruesome deeds in Dusker and Enmar. All so that you may acquire the strength you need. All for a purpose. So the flame member is like working with them, but not really? Ingrid's birthday. No, we don't really care. We'll send her some flowers. Sure, why not? Oh, wow. What sad music. All right. Well, this episode has gone on long enough. It's over an hour already, so I'm going to end it here. Um, wow. A lot of things to think about. A lot of things to think about going forward. But yeah, what the story is really starting to ramp up now. We're starting to see different things coming together. So yeah, I hope you guys are enjoying it as much as I am. And I will see you guys in the next episode. Peace.